David Belcher from St. Joseph's in Durham. Uh, one of the issues facing our church uh, is what some people are calling open table uh, or communion without baptism, which we're going to be discussing this weekend. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'm kind of aware also, though, that one of the main emphases, the theological emphases of the understanding of the church within the Episcopal Church is our baptismal ecclesiology. Mm -hmm. We place a lot of emphasis on church as growing out of uh, our immersion in the font, uh, that Baptism is the fount of all ministry, especially. And I'm interested in how you think those two connect or disconnect and how we might talk about those in today's church. Thank you. I think the church is really struggling because we separated the two. We separated baptism from communion back somewhere in the Middle Ages uh, when the bishop wasn't there to baptize everybody. We said, oh, well, it's not really done yet. You have to wait until the bishop comes around and confirms your baptism. And then in this country, when we didn't have bishops for 200 years, we said, well, if you really, 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 really want to be confirmed, you can come to communion anyway. Uh, in the new prayer book, the one we still call new, we said, <laughs> we said anybody who's baptized can come to the table. Uh, I think we're in a season of going back and remembering that baptism and feeding are intri intricately linked, that they shouldn't ever have been separated. Uh, when we can recover that sense, I don't think we're going to have to ask the question in the way we're asking it now. Uh, when we say, come and join this community, come and learn what it means to be part of Christ's body, it's going to come back to being one sacrament again, or one sacramental event. Uh, we're recovering a sense of Lent as solidarity with those preparing to be baptized. And then this e incredible, mysterious experience of death and rebirth and being fed. In the early church, they did it with milk and honey. Uh, that you are welcome at the banquet table of the Lord. Uh, when we can, when we can re-educate ourselves, reform ourselves, it won't be a question. Come and join this community in its fullness. Take a bath and be fed. <laughs>